Today, I want to teach you that to write well about reading, writers don't just note symbols and come up with a quick meaning, like the bird means hope. Instead, they track the symbol across the story, thinking and writing about what it means in different parts. Writers, let's try some of this work together. First, on a text where there is some really clear symbolism. I want you to watch the music video of Wings. As you watch and listen to it, let's research symbolism. Pause the video so that you can watch and listen to the music video and have a copy of the lyrics ready while you are listening. What seemed symbolic? What are you thinking? Take a few minutes to jot in your writing notebook. Writers, you might have said that the basketball shoes symbolize dreams and hopes. They might symbolize the need to fit in and the way that kids try to fit in by having the right stuff. It's about pressure. Here's the thing. When you analyze symbolism, it's not going to be just one thing. Chances are, a symbol will have multiple meanings, and those meanings might change across the story. So let's go back into the text, and let's look more carefully. This time, look for how the symbol of the shoes changes as you progress through the text. Do what you'll want to do as a reader which is that every time you notice something is symbolic, like the shoes, underline that line or jot your thinking about what the symbolism seems to be meaning now. I was seven years old when I got my first pair and I stepped outside and I was like, Mama, this air bubble right here, it's going to make me fly. I hit back court and when I jumped, I jumped. I swear I got so high. I touched the net. Mom, I touched the net. This is the best day of my life. Air Maxes were next. That air bubble, that mesh, the box, the smell, the stuffing, the tread. In school, I was so cool. I knew that I couldn't crease them. My friends couldn't afford them. Four stripes, some Adidas. On the court, I wasn't the best, but my kicks were like the pros. Yo, I stuck out my tongue so everyone could see that logo. Nike Air Flight, but bad was so dope. And then my friend Carlos's brother got murdered for his fours. Whoa. Okay, in the first stanza, the boy got his first pair of shoes, and he's so excited. He thinks the shoes will make him fly. But it's more than just the shoes. He thinks the shoes will change him and make him a superhero basketball player. Maybe the shoes are about his hopes, big hopes for the future. So then in the second part of the song, the boy talks about the next pair of shoes, how they look, how they feel. But again, it's more than that. The shoes make him feel a certain way. He thinks the shoes will make everyone at school think he's cool and maybe earn him respect. So do the shoes mean something else here? Hmm. Writers, it's your turn to continue this work on your own. Go back to the lesson platform for the next activity.